Hey guys, how's it going? Zach Buller YGO here. Um, just wanted to give you guys a quick update. I know my content has been a little, little shaky lately. Uh, that's mostly, you know, due to travel. Um, I'm still kind of recovering from YCS LA. It was super fun though. And, uh, I know I've posted a couple videos like here and there throughout the week. I think I posted like one deck profile and then like a couple of shorts, nothing too special. Um, Well, I, I guess I just wanted to apologize for, like, the lack of consistency there. I've been pretty on top of it overall, but um, springtime is really tough. Uh, it's when uh, my articles for TCG Player tend to ramp up. It's when, uh, you know, the competitive season really gets going, stuff like that. And I don't ever want to post a video that... I don't want to post content just to post it. Um... I genuinely want to only post stuff that I'm, like, really excited about or that I think you guys will find interesting, uh, stuff like that. So, like, I guess a good example is I've been playing Sprite the last few days. Uh, I don't know that everybody wants to see my updated Sprite deck. Um, I, I would love to talk about it. Um, but I don't want to give you guys boring content. Um, so I'm kind of, like, working working with that. Um, yeah, so if you guys have any suggestions down below, let me know. That'd be great. Uh, I'm happy to talk about, you know, like, problem-solving deck building. That's one thing I've been, I've been meaning to record and I've just been really lazy about, honestly. Uh, or kind of, like, continuing the, 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 the content where I'm, I'm talking about, like, generalized stuff. So, like, the, the math behind deck building was, was a big one. Um... I want to talk about, like, approaching deck building from a problem-solving standpoint, or, like, how to identify the problems in a deck. That's been one that um, I've had a, a lot of questions about from players who uh, who know me. Um, or even, like, the... I have a... Uh, I wrote an article on it, like, a couple years ago. It's called, like, the KISS system, where it's just... It's about keeping it super simple, um, and that's honestly how I try to approach deck building. If you guys want to see stuff like that, please let me know. That's really easy content that I, I, I do enjoy doing. Um, I just have been kind of like shaky on just posting stuff for the sake of posting it. Um, we are almost to 1000 subscribers. Uh, so be on the watch out or the lookout, watch out, be on the lookout for, uh, that giveaway that I, I, I posted the poll about or the, the community post about. Uh, I just have to set up a couple of things like a, like a Gleam account and then get everything ready to go. But it's packaged. It's ready to go. I'm super excited for whoever gets it. And uh, for anyone who's here for mostly like the punk content, um, it'll definitely be coming. Uh, I'm a little burnt out on it. I don't I don't want to lie to you guys. I don't I don't want to play like the same the same deck for too, too long if it really isn't working and I'm not having a lot of fun with it. And uh I don't want to post decks where it's like three cards different. That's just, that's not something that I find entertaining. And I think it's a waste of your time. I think it's a waste of my time. And I don't want to do that. So I don't. <laughs> uh, but I do know that with Cyberstorm Access, there will be a updated Punk Gold Pride deck. That's for sure. Uh, I will probably be updating my Pure Punk deck pretty soon. Uh, I have a uh, Synchro Sprite deck I want to work on. Um, that one's, like, more of an Ad Emancipator one. I saw, like, a guy at my local was doing it. It was super cool. Uh, there's some different versions of Dark World I want to do. Um, so yeah, just let me know. I, this video was really, originally meant to be, like, a 60-second short, just letting you guys know that I'm, I'm not, like, I haven't forgotten to post or anything. I just, um, it's really hard to post if there's not anything that I, like, I want to post. And, uh, right now we're in that really weird spot of the format where, like, uh, Hypernova's kind of old, and then we're waiting for Cyberstorm Access, and the form, like, the, the YCS bump is over, so we could talk about, like, the update, updated meta into that. I could even talk about, like, from my perspective, why certain stuff wins or doesn't win. Um, just let me know. I, I, I would love to just kind of talk more theory and just talk about the game in general. Um, but I also just wanted to do, again, uh, extend my thank you to everybody for the support, uh, all the awesome feedback, 
Um, even in the videos where I do something and I get it like wildly wrong, uh, I really appreciate any and all feedback because the whole point of the channel is to kind of capture my journey of getting back to being the best I've ever been and, 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 and superseding that. Uh, I don't even know if that's the right word for it. Or just getting beyond that point, like breaking the self-imposed glass ceiling, but then also helping players who maybe want to get better themselves um, and kind of giving people the tools to do it. So I guess that's really about it. Um, sorry for the random post at like, I don't know, midnight, probably like closer to 1am. It was just something I was thinking about as I'm scrolling through, uh, Twitter and stuff and seeing everybody talk about some awesome, cool stuff that they've been doing over the weekend and seen a bunch of awesome regional decks. So keep that in mind and let me know what you guys want to see down below. Um, if it's something that kind of resonates with me, I'm definitely going to do it. And until next time, have a wonderful night.